So today I wanted to give you guys a video about spring trends and colored pants are so in. Not even colored denim, which I will be using just because I already had colored denim, but colored pants in general. So anything that is colored and you put it on your bottom, totally works. So basically what this video is, is I have three different color pants and I know a really big spring trend is color blocking and color blocking I know isn't for everyone. So I did two outfits for each pants, one of them being color blocked and the other one not color blocked. Just because if you're not ready for the whole color blocking world, you can improvise and just do another idea. Um, also, for color, if you've never color blocked before, I strongly recommend going on the internet and printing yourself out a color wheel, which I know sounds so embarrassing, but I'm pretty sure none of us are sitting there aren't majors because I couldn't even tell you complimentary colors without looking at a color. I took art class like six years ago, so I really have no idea what the order is. But it helps so much because then you can look at your closet, see colors that remind you of that, find contrasting colors, find complementary. So I strongly suggest that. Also, as you will see in some of the outfits, some of the outfits that I didn't color block, I still kind of sorted it by adding an accessory. Accessory is a great way to start color blocking if you're completely unsure on how to do it. It's the perfect way to kind of get a taste of what works and what doesn't work. Also, I strongly recommend makeup. Just adding a different color makeup to your look will actually, you're color blocking without actually realizing it and it still looks really, really nice. So I'm going to quit battling and show you guys the pants. First pair of pants I'm going to show you guys are these yellow denim capris and these are from Rue 21 and to be completely honest with you, these were only, they only cost me $13 and the only reason I bought them is because I bought a shirt to go with them. Which isn't even featured in this video because I bought these last year, so I don't know if you can still get these. I'm sure Forever 21 has yellow pants. But I bought these last year and I bought the shirt and the only reason I bought the pants is because I, I liked how it looked with the shirt. But it's not even featured because I really, really don't like how it looks anymore. But these are really, really nice and I wish I got more wear out of these than I do because yellow is just my favorite color one. And happy and just really springy and it's just a nice intro to spring piece. So the first outfit features my denim jeans that are yellow and from room 21. I paired this with a shirt I got from Discovery a heck of a long time ago so I have no idea how much it costs. And on my feet I'm wearing my Keds that were about $30 from Journeys. And what I really like about this outfit is pairing the contrasting colors of the pink fuchsia to the yellow. I think it's really, really nice complementary colors. In this outfit, once again, I'm wearing my yellow jeans from Rue 21. And then for my top, I have a thrifted top that I showed you guys in a haul. And I have a crossbody messenger bag, but it's from Charlotte Russe. It is seriously the most reliable thing ever. You can shove anything in there and it all fits. And then on my feet, I am wearing these Converse that took me forever to find. And they're about $45 from the Converse store. And what's so special and unique about them is they're all white, but they do not have the red and blue pinstripes. They only have the black Pinstripe and that was so the next pair of pants I have are also from Rue 21 and they are these sky blue no not sky. I don't know they're kind of a mix between they're not really turquoise I don't know how they're picking up on camera but it's an aqua blue I, I'm gonna go with an aqua blue mixed with a tint 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 of sky blue because they are brighter than an aqua and what I part is the bottom. They actually have zippers to them, which is so freaking cool just because it's another trend that you're adding on without actually meaning to. These cost me $11 and I do know these are still in store. I paired it with a top from Very Also. I have no idea how much it costs once again. And then I have the necklace I bought from Wet Seal for I think a dollar that I hauled for you guys. And then I'm wearing a ring that's from Avon, and it's actually a flower, but when you open it up, it's a watch, which is pretty cool. And then I just kept it nice and polished with my brown flats from Charlotte Russe that were $10. Outfit is a perfect example of when you can play with accessories and add the color blocking in, because I also incorporated the color purple in my color block by wearing the watch. So in this outfit, I clearly feel like a badass, hence why I'm walking like I don't even know what. But I have just this yellow sort of peplum top that I got from Wet Seal for about $5.
It's kind of peplum, but not really, but it's, I don't know, it's pretty cute. And then I paired it with my leather jacket from Charlotte Russe that I practically live in. Plus, I paired my favorite black cross necklace that I got in a drag queen store for $4 are just the blue denim but I think it's really cool because with this it has the zippers and then it has the blue and then the leather jacket it just gives me a tough look and a red bandana because that's my signature and it gave me a more badass look so the last pair of pants I strongly recommend everyone should have in their wardrobe just because the color is absolutely beautiful I know they were, this color was really big in the fall but I'm incorporating it into my spring outfits and that is cobalt blue and it is just gorgeous color. These pants are from Target. I do know they are there right now. They're on sale for $7. Really good deal for pants. They're not the best quality pants. They're almost like legging material. But they're still really nice. And cobalt blue is just a gorgeous color. And it's just really easy to style. So if you were only to get one colored pant, totally go with cobalt blue. Just because, in my opinion, it's the most versatile. I'm a bird, apparently. And I got this top from Charlotte Russe, and, I, and it's so short, you do need something underneath it. So I just paired it with a red tank top to also go along with the color blocking. The red tank top is from Forever 21, I think. They're about $3 there. And, and then I had these cobalt blue pants that I am featuring, and those are from Target. And I paired it with my flats that I got for $3 from Wet Seal just because it also ties in another color and brings back the fuchsia in the shirt with the shoes. The last outfit has to be the one I'm most excited to show you guys. I paired my cobalt blue pants with a band t-shirt which I'm featuring Lady Gaga. This shirt like four years ago from Hot Topic. And then I'm featuring sunglasses that I got from Warped Tour like six years ago. And then I'm featuring a bag that I got thrifting. And, and then the highlight slash staple slash everything is my shoes. I love these shoes and I felt like my outfit couldn't be complete and I could not do a color blocking outfit without these shoes because it is every color possible. And these are Converse. I got them from Nordstrom. They're a size too big. Converse are really, really versatile. So thank you guys so much for watching and also stay tuned for a spring 2012 lookbook which is just going to have all of the trends pushed into one video which I'm super super excited about. Thank you guys so much for watching again and hope you have a great day. Bye!